Welcome everyone! Today we're going to explore the three main types of plate boundaries. The convergent, divergent, and transform. These boundaries define how tectonic plates interact with each other, leading to various geological phenomena. Let's dive in. First, let's discuss convergent boundaries. This occur where two tectonic plates move toward each other. When they collide, several scenarios can happen depending on the type of plates involved, which are oceanic continental, oceanic oceanic, and continental continental. In oceanic continental, an oceanic plate collides with a continental plate. The denser oceanic plate is forced beneath the continental plate in a process known as subduction. This often creates a deep ocean trench and can lead to volcanic activity on the continent. Oceanic Oceanic When two oceanic plates collide, one plate is subducted beneath the other. This can lead to the formation of volcanic island arcs and deep ocean trenches. Continental Continental When two continental plates collide, neither plate is subducted because they are both relatively buoyant. Instead, the collision pushes the crust upward, creating mountain ranges. Next, we have divergent boundaries. Where two tectonic plates move away from each other, this movement creates new crust as magma rises from the mantle and solidifies at the surface. Divergent boundaries are often found at mid-ocean ridges, which are underwater mountain ranges. Mid-ocean ridges. As the plates pull apart, magma rises to fill the gap, creating new oceanic crust. The Mid-Atlantic Ridge is a well-known example of this process. Rift Valleys On land, divergent boundaries can create rift valleys. As the plates pull apart, the crust may sink, forming a valley. In both cases, these boundaries are associated with volcanic activity and earthquakes due to the movement and creation of new crust. Finally, let's talk about transform boundaries. These occur where two plates slide past each other horizontally. Unlike convergent and divergent boundaries, transform boundaries do not typically create or destroy crust. Instead, they are characterized by horizontal motion. The most common types of transform boundary is a strike slip fault where the movement of the plate is primarily horizontal. As the plate side pass each other, they can cause significant earthquake. Transform boundaries are crucial in understanding seismic activity. As the friction between sliding plates can lead to the release of stress, the form of earthquakes. Understanding these boundaries helps us grasp the dynamic nature of our planet and the processes that shape its surface.